what a busy place. That way, Fontana Village, we're actually headed that way to leave. Look at that, Karen, 129. Knoxville. North Carolina Scenic Byway. We've been on it, haven't we? <laughs> Ready, aren't we? Mm -hmm. <gasps> oh, that was like a dangerous pass on a curve. Okay, here we are. Tell the dragon. Yes. Um, this is my first time being up here, I guess. Yep, yeah, and we got a Class B van. <laughs> and Mike's driving, thank goodness. Yeah. I've been on it uh, many, many times on a motorcycle, right, not, not in a Class B van. So we're going to go up through here. We're going to stop, have a uh, picnic on the side of the road. Mm -hmm. Did you know that um, there is a road that comes from Cades Cove over to the Tail of the Dragon? I did not know that. Yeah, we'll show that to you up here. It's a one way. You have to be coming from Cades Cove toward the dragon. Yes. And then we'll end up over at the beginning in the North Carolina side of 129 uh -huh. and we will um, show them the shop where you can buy things and get something to eat. And Mike, you were telling me this is uh, the most popular motorcycle road in the United States and probably the world. Yeah, probably so. You're getting ready to drive on it. We <laughs> can't record it all. It's 11 miles, I believe 311 curves, something like that. I can't remember everything. Whew. <laughs> so Karen's going to have the camera, we'll record some, then we're going to pull over, chill out, and do some video and picnic. Yes. Come along with us. This is actually the beginning of the Tail of the Dragon on the um, Tennessee side, right here. I'll show you, but you see the lake? I'm going through there. Yeah, posing for their photo. It's a good place to stop and get a photo right here. Here's the easy part of the tail of the dragon. Look at that turkey right there. See him? Oh yeah. So I'm kind of excited a little bit. It's been a while since I've been on here. And we are just going to take our time we don't recommend this, but there are pull-offs where you can pull over. Right now, there's nobody behind us. Places that will be taking your picture, if you want to go and get a picture, you can do that. So somebody's taking them for you, and you can go buy one. Yeah. Yeah. But this is pretty much typically it, only sharper turns. But like I was saying, Parsons Branch Road, I don't think I mentioned it, comes from Cades Cove up to the tail of the dragon up here on the left. It's one way and um, you want to check and make sure that it's open because it's closed a lot during the year, especially the bad weather. You want to make sure that probably you've got a four wheel drive, places a two wheel drive could make it. You cross the creek like four or five times and um, it's a lot of fun. Came through there several times on the motorcycle. It's near halfway through Cades Cove. And that's where you turn up. But here we are, Karen. What are you thinking? Yeah. It's curvy. Just getting started, but <laughs> I know what you mean now. You know what we mean. Oh, he's got a big load on here.
have a situation going on here. Big T has jumped out of his bed on the busiest, curviest road in America. And he's sliding around everywhere back there, so we're going to have to pull over and grab him. Somewhere. I, we can hear his little nails yeah, scooting across that, that the view. floor. Look out through there. That's the very map. pretty. So the temperature is 57 out and today. It's, and it's 12 noon. So a cool day here in the mountains. Yes, in May too, the end of May. These guys and gals who ride this all the time, they memorize just about all these terms. Mm -hmm. Here's Killboy. All right, so we should be there soon. So you said you saw the one girl wreck how often are there wrecks? Oh, uh, I'd say just about every busy weekend there's a wreck here. Yeah, just because there's so many people here and it's going to happen, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, as a matter of fact, at the end up here where the main shop's at, they have something called, uh, I think it's the Tree of Shame. And it's just different parts of motorcycles that's hung in the tree. We'll show that to everybody. Oh, okay. From a crash, I guess. Yes. Oh, that was like a dangerous pass on a curve. Okay, Parsons Branch Road's coming up here on the left. See right there, it says do not enter, it's one way. That's coming from Cades Cove? Yeah, right Okay. There. Beautiful drive. Found us a place to pull in, watch some traffic come by, and picnic. Yeah, sounds good. As you can see, they're coming through here pretty quick. And these are not some of the fastest riders you'll see. And you got the Harleys too, but some of these guys on these Harleys can ride. It's crazy. It's a little cool sitting back in here in these mountains. I'm not going to lie. With the breeze blowing through here, it's pretty. You know, I, I used to come to this very spot on my motorcycle and sit for hours and hours and hours. But just wanted to show you guys a little bit of the tail of the dragon. If you haven't been on it, you can get a good idea of what it's like. We're going to have a little picnic here. question what? could you nap back there with all that racket going on not much no she's uh, been laying down back there and 
on the bed. <laughs> yeah. So we got some ham. Yeah, we have ham. We'll make us a ham sandwich here. Look at that. That would be something to bring through the dragon right there, man. He's got a lot of traffic behind him too. Look at that. We love these picnics beside the road, don't we? Yes. Thank you. Big T. He's sitting here watching the traffic come through. Give him a piece of ham. Oh boy. Mmm. We're ready, aren't we? Mm -hmm. And we got some barbecue chips here, don't we? Yes. That'll be good. A little picnic. Oh, I see a floated one right off the back. Oh. Can I have it? No. <laughs> <laughs> she put me out of that one. Get That's all I need. That's plenty. All right. Cheers. <laughs> mm -mm. This is the view Karen has while we're sitting here. That's hard to beat. Mm -hmm. It's pretty. And straight out the van there, you can see our view. And this way, got motorcycle. Cars passes. Here comes a truck with a trailer. <laughs> We're gonna enjoy lunch here, and then we'll take you guys on up to the beginning of the Tale of the Dragon. And show you this the store. Yeah. Here we go. Got turned around, didn't we? <laughs> Good lunch. Mm-hmm. Look at this big dip right here. Sideways. There was mile marker one, so one more mile and we'll be at the beginning North Carolina side of the Tail of the Dragon. And the traffic is picking up, isn't it? It is. Weather's gotten a little bit better. Yeah. A little sunnier. It has warmed up. It's actually nice out. It was 57. Got here. You know what? What? I haven't seen any other class B's. No. But we did see that big uh, Unimog or whatever that thing was. Uh, of course, we're sitting a trend, maybe. <laughs> I doubt it. Look at what's coming up, y'all. Big old curve. Uh -huh. Listen, I have to say, you're doing a great job. I'm proud of you. So far, we're not through here yet. Well, just about. You still look a little Limit is 30, by the way. Well, we know everybody's not doing that. <laughs> right. Yeah. And there was a lot of state troopers down at the other end. There'll probably be some up here at this end. Mm -hmm. Here's the big turn to the right. Check this thing out. And it's only 15 miles an hour. Safely, I guess. Big T, he's hanging in here with us, ain't he? He is. And here we are. Welcome to North Carolina. Yes. And right around this corner is what's known as a wheelie, wheelie alley or something. They leave from down here and they pop wheelies all the way up the side of the hill here. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Will state troopers let you do wheelies? Look at that big sign. Mm -hmm. Deal scat motorcycle. I don't know if they could consider that reckless driving or not. That's what I mean. Historic Tobacco Lodge. He's flying. Here's a sign that says Robbinsville 18 at Chiraholla Skyway 27. And I'm telling you folks, if you want a beautiful drive, we got a video from the Chiraholla Skyway. Mm -hmm. We do. But on a day like today, it would be beautiful up there. Yes, it would. Just big sweeping curves. Now, right down over here to the left, this is where we're headed. We're going to go in here, see if we can find a place to park. 
And this is lodging too, right? They do have some lodging here, yes. Look at all the motorcycles. Oh, I don't see any place to park. What a busy place. That way, Fontana Village, we're actually headed that way to leave. Look at that, Karen, 129. Well, Knoxville. North Carolina Scenic Byway. We've been on it, haven't we? <laughs> I hear a band playing. Here we are. Look at all the bikes up through there. Wow, and there's another place right over here you can shop. It's pretty popular too. Fuel right here. Let's go inside here first. There's a general store. I've eaten here. It's actually some pretty good food here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. 318 curves and 11 miles. Dealsgap.com. So business is good. This place is called Deals Gap, right? Yep. Deals Gap. The Tale of the Dragon Deals Gap. Any nice hats? The Dragon. Three hundred eighteen curves, eleven miles. Yeah, that's what the little dragon had on it. So there's all the shirts you can see up there. And all their logo stuff, drinking coffee cups, sunglasses, and here's uh, tags for the bikes. It's pretty cool. And that's the restaurant in there? Yes, it is. Back this way is the restaurant. The Dragon's Den Grill. This guy. Tree of shame. Look that shoe has a year on it, 2012. Oh, I see that. Mirrors. So they do have some places to stay overnight. Thank you. Well, guys, we hope you enjoyed this. Yes. We had a great time today, and yes. thanks for coming along with us. Definitely an experience. Yeah, you need to come and uh, <laughs> check this place out sometime. Yes. Till next time, or Fridays. Forever. Bye-bye, everybody. Big T's in the van asleep. Okay.